The shark gets closer and closer. It is only a foot or two away from the crocodile's long tail before it abruptly turns away. Why did it call off the hunt? The crocodile went for a rock and climbed up. The shark simply couldn't follow it. The shark swims off, possibly to find another food source. There aren't a lot of fish or other marine life in the waters shown in the video, but the shark probably knows where it can find a tasty snack. The crocodile continues to climb and swim among the rocks. Still underwater, the crocodile uses the rocks to stay protected and out of reach. It eventually lifts its snout out of the water briefly and then returns to swimming. Once it is sure that the shark has left the area, the crocodile returns to deeper water and goes on its way. Shark is crocodile. Who would win in a fight? The great white shark is a powerful predator, with an impressive set of teeth and the strength to take on even the largest prey. Meanwhile, saltwater crocodiles are no less formidable foes. They are incredibly strong and have been known to crush turtles in their jaws. However, when it comes to a fight between these two deadly creatures, the great white shark has one incredible advantage speed. This gives them a huge edge when hunting or being hunted underwater. Not only would this animal likely spot its prey first, but its agility and acceleration also allow them to deliver an almost instantaneous attack that can be devastatingly effective. The shark's razor-sharp teeth give it the ability to tear through flesh quickly and easily, far faster than what any crocodile could muster up. So while both species are certainly dangerous adversaries, when push comes to shove or bite, it's clear who is king of the sea is the great white shark.